Today I'm learning, we're gonna show you how to do an effect that looks something like this. Brent, look what I found. What do you got there, Bobby? It's, it's the box of truth. The, the box of what? The box of truth, I found it at a, at a hidden temple. What is, and, what is the box of truth? I don't know, I, I heard that there are. Well, well, hold on, what are you doing with that? I'm gonna open it. Well, are you sure you wanna do that? Bobby. I heard it gives you godly power. Well, think about it. Oh, well, I think you should think about this for a second before you go and open that, Bobby. Let's do it. Bobby, no, no, Bobby. Oh! What's going on, guys? I'm Bobby. And I am Brent. And you're watching. Whoa. Learning with Bobby and Brent. So if you want to skip right to the tutorial, we've got a timestamp in the description. You can get right into the video. Yeah. But if you want to stick around for our goofiness, yes. then watch, just, then continue Just keep watching. watching already. I mean, come on. Okay guys, so today's tutorial comes actually from a viewer who requested that we do this effect. His name is Peter Raha and he said- Thanks Peter. Thank you Peter. And he said, uh, hey, you know when a box gets opened and a super bright light shines out of it with a choir going, oh! Um, yeah, how do you do that? And then he said, sorry, that's the best way I could phrase it. We were, That's we're, kind of the perfect way to phrase it, if you ask me. It is, I mean, it we is, understood what you're talking it about. It's pretty much spot on. Yeah, because... This is kind of exactly what just happened, Like, right? how do we title this video? We're wondering, like, what do we title it? I think we're yeah. going to go with Heavenly uh, Light Effect. Yeah. So, but yeah, I, I mean, it's a tough thing to phrase, and I think you phrased it well, Peter. Yeah, so, thank you, Peter. Thank you for your comment. Love it. Let's show you how to do the tutorial. I like it. I love it. I want some more of it. Show me how to do it, Bobby. Woo, Brent! So here we have our video that we showed you. Yes. Of me opening up Pandora's box. Scene one of Geek Mythology. Geek Mythology, season one, scene one. And so here we have uh, basically just simple as this, a video and an audio clip. Now, what we're gonna wanna do is we're going to zoom in here. And right before I open the box, we're gonna hit our C key on the keyboard and that brings up our cut tool. Oh. And we're going to make a cut right here on our video. Now that we have our clips separated, uh, the reason we did that is because we're going to be applying an effect to our second video here on the right. And this effect requires a lot of rendering, and we want to make sure that the rendering is only being used on the clip where we need it. Gotcha. So we split it up so we can just add an effect on that one part right there. And the effect that we're going to add is a lens flare effect. So, lens flare. Lens flare. JJ Abrams approved lens flare. Oh yes. So we're going to go into our effects right here and we're going to search L-E-N-S-F-L-A-R-E. -E. That's how you spell it. Yes. And I only know that because I spelled it wrong so many times that I now know how to spell it. Awesome. So we're going to drag that right onto our video here. Pretty simple. So look at Brent. It creates a little sun. A sun, sun. Look at that. It's created a little sun effect. That's kind of neat. And if we go over to our effect controls here, we can see the different uh, ways that we can manipulate this. So mm -hmm. we've got our flare center, so, okay. which changes the direction of where the flare is coming from. Okay, so yeah, we're, okay, I see what's happening there. And then gotcha. we have the flare brightness below that, so. which changes the brightness of the flare. So oh yeah, really oh. Bright, oh man. Or. You're being all consumed now. Or not so bright. Okay. And I'm being consumed, but not anymore. And then we have the lens type. We've got a few different types. We have 50 to 300 millimeter zoom, yep. 35 millimeter prime, and 105 millimeter prime. Interesting. Now, then the last thing is the, the blend width. Uh, we don't really need to use that. Yeah, so blend forget of it. Forget it was even there. Don't even use the blend width. We if you say anything story. about that parameter, you're just gonna, you're out of here. You're, you're done. You're done. This you're done for the day. Episode for you. Ejected from the game. So, we have our parameters. We know exactly what we're going to use for our effect. Okay. Let's get right into making this effect and building I it. I want to see it happen. I want so, it to come to life. We talked about keyframes before, right, Brent? Okay. Yeah, they're key. They're very key. Keyframes are key. You got to know how to use keyframes. You have a bunch of videos about it. Mm -hmm. So if you look over here on the left of our effects, we've got our little uh, toggle animation stopwatches. Stopwatch. And if you select it, it will create a keyframe in your timeline over here. Cool. So that'll allow you to manipulate the effect and uh, change it throughout different time points in your video. So we're gonna start off by uh, making sure we know exactly where we want the lens to come in, in the video. So let's find a point where the box starts to open right uh, about there. 
That looks pretty good. Now what we want to happen right there is we want the beam to sort of start to come out of the little mm. crack right there. So how do we do that? We first are going to go to our lens flare effect and change the lens type to 105 millimeter prime. Okay, yeah, that looks more just like a heavenly light there. The, the, the difference between a red heaven and a white heaven is surprisingly big. Yeah, red heaven, I think they have another name for it. Uh, it's yes. called hell. 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 I might be mistaken on the pronunciation, but I think it's called hell. Red heaven. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like I like red heaven better. That's, I think. That actually sounds like it could be a Netflix series too. Yeah, maybe, red heaven. Maybe we'll start that one too. Red, red heaven. That really does sound like a Netflix yeah, series. Yeah, either that or a bad NBC like yeah. like forty five minute drama like <laughs> Red Heaven. Like the devil's in Manhattan. Yeah, yeah. And some, he's a lawyer. <laughs> no, it also sounds like it could be one of those like creepy like uh, dramas where there's like a creepy town. Mm. And, and, and you don't know like what's going on. What's in the going town. on in Red Heaven? What's going on in Red Heaven? And once you go to Red Heaven, you never, you never leave. Ooh. You know that kind of thing. I might watch that. Once you start asking questions in Red Heaven, you know. Yeah. Then, oof. You know, you don't. You're, you disappear. Yes. Things get real, <laughs> real fast. Can we greenlight this show too? Can we greenlight? I think, I think you could probably get this one on a Bravo. I think so too. I think Bravo picked this one up. <laughs> They're doing Bates Motel. It's kind of yeah. similar. Let's do it. Yeah, I think let's we do, do it. it. I'll be on the phone with Bravo later, selling this show. <laughs> Next year, next fall, Red Heaven. I could totally see it too. We'll, we'll put a movie poster of it or a show. show and poster it'll of it right be starring here. me and Brent. <laughs> We've changed our lens type effect. Cool. Now we want to change the flare center. Sure. So we're going to use uh, these little tools right here to drag and manipulate where the center is. Okay. So if we click on this left number over here, mm -hmm. we can drag it cool. horizontally. That's our x axis. And then we, you can see the, uh, the nice little lens flare. Uh, circles here. Yeah, you see the little, the little, the little dipsy do, little, little dipsy do flares. There's a name around. for those, but I forget what they're called. Yeah, because we're, we're just video editors, man. Yeah, we don't know the names. Maybe they're ghosts. Orb name. It's an orb. It's an orb. Let's just say they're called spirit orbs, Sp right? We're gonna call them spirit orbs. Yep. So we've got some spirit orbs here, and we're going to take our flare center, this this number on the right here, and we're gonna drag it down. All right. Okay. There we go. Okay, so now you can see it's starting to come out of the box. That, that's that's looking good. Now, how do we uh, sort of determine how bright this is? That's a good question, Bobby. You tell me. I'm going to tell you right now, Brent. So we're going to click on our flare brightness here All right. on the stopwatch, and it's going to create the keyframe that we were telling you about earlier. Yes. And if we hit our right arrow key, it can bring us a few frames forward in our video. Okay. And I think we're going to want the brightness to be about where it is now. At this, um, point. at this point, maybe a little brighter. So we're gonna take our, our brightness and we're gonna move it up. I'd say that looks pretty good. Nice, for there. I'm feeling the heavenliness. So now let's zoom in by clicking our plus tool on the keyboard. Okay. And we can go back to our first keyframe by selecting this go to previous keyframe arrow. Now, right here, we probably want the brightness to be about zero. Pretty low, we just want it to be starting out there. We want it to be starting out. Maybe just a hint. Maybe a hint right there. And now we'll go back a few more keyframes by pressing our left arrow key. It's closed there, so we want zero there. And we'll want zero right there. So now if we go at this a little bit and slowly, slowly, we can surely. sort of uh, move our keyframes around and make sure that it fits and matches up the right way. So now as I open the box, it gets brighter and brighter. And then I do a nice big swing right here. Oh. Where I really open the box. It's almost like the light's like blowing you back. It's so intense. It's so, so intense. So what we're going to do is we're going to really brighten that up there. We're going to blow up the brightness Woo! all the way. It's like face melting, like yeah. Raiders of the Lost Ark style. Bam. Ark of the Covenant. Just, our faces just got melted off there. The heavenly gods have spoken. Bobby and Brent have woken. We are so woke. We are so, so woke. Now, I think what... What we want to do is, it seems like it gets a little too bright too fast. So we can okay. actually go in the middle here and uh, <coughs> adjust it a little bit more so that maybe the brightness is so bright that it's covering the box, mm -hmm. but it hasn't yet taken up all the space of the room. Gotcha. Until we start to scream here. <laughs> Let's see how it works. Bobby, no, no, Bobby. Oh, yeah, that looks pretty good. Okay, so we've got our lens flare effect no, now. No, Bobby. Woo! So it looks pretty good. It looks like we're opening the gates we're to heaven. We're being consumed by the mystery box. So what do we need now? We need the heavenly effect. Well, what you can do is you can go onto YouTube or uh, you know, if you have a, a sound effects stock account somewhere and find a heavenly effect or you can just record it yourself. Yeah, like if, you're, Brent would do. if you're awesome whiffing poofs. Uh, 
<laughs> you can do that yourself like us. <laughs> How heavenly was that? That was so heavenly. It was the most heavenly thing I've ever heard. My God, I, I almost started to weep openly I mean, at our heavenliness. There you go, a single tear right here. Oh, oh yeah. Look at that. Look at that glisten. That is uh, that's making me sad. I swear by that glisten. Just seeing your tear is making me sad. I gotta wipe that tear off. Whew. Yeah, wow. This wow. is this is intense. This is like this is how I felt on the season finale of uh, Red Red Heaven. Red Heaven. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I didn't expect it to get so emotional at the end. I know. Back to our uh, little tutorial here. If we so can. sound effects. Okay, so we want to make sure that we have a sound effect. We've grabbed this one from YouTube here, mm -hmm. and we're gonna double click on it in our uh, project folder. And yeah. that's going to bring up our source monitor. So if Ooh. we select on our uh, audio, uh, what we can actually do is we can drag this into our timeline. And it will just drag the audio. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, it's a really cool little feature. Yeah, especially like about. when you grab stuff from YouTube and there's a video associated with the audio. And if you just yeah. want the audio, it's kind of a pain in the butt. Pop it in pro there. Pro tip. Pro tip right there. That is a pro tip. Bing, pro tip right there. So... We've got our, our audio for that. Uh, we've also got some uh, transition sound effects that we've got here. Cool. And we're gonna drag in one that we, we got earlier, which is uh, this nice little... So we're gonna have that sound effect come in. That uh, adds to the heavenliness of it all. It'll add to the, the epic heavenliness of opening the box. And then one other thing that we can do that'll really help this is uh, we, we're gonna add a reverb on me and Brent screaming. Ooh, we're gonna do a little audio effects today too. Audio effects, learning and Arning. So we're gonna go to our effects and just search reverb. So we open up our parameters here for the uh, reverb effect. You can go to presets and we're gonna select Great Hall, because that sounds more like a church. Yeah. And let's drag the room size up to like Want nine. to be a huge room. It's a pretty big room. We'll drive the wetness huge. up a little bit. Let's take a look at the, our final effect here. Let's... Before you go and open that, Bobby. Let's do it. Bobby, no, no, Bobby. Ah! Well, there you go. There's your uh, heavenly, pretty cool. heavenly effect. Um, you might have heard a couple little pops here there in the audio. We didn't really mix it. You yeah. probably want to mix it better so that you don't get clipping audio or whatever like we were just there. Yeah, when we screamed, you got a little bit of clips. Yeah. Um, well, so. I mean, yeah. So there's some clippage there, but I mean, we could also adjust the volume so that you don't get clipping in the master audio. Yeah. But, you know, for the sake of this tutorial and to not waste your time too much. <laughs> yeah. We just let it be what it is. Even though we are the masters of wasting time. We are the... Yeah, I know, right? Uh, how dare I suggest that like wasting time is like a problem? We are the time wasters. We love wasting time. That's another good idea for a sci-fi show. Time wasters. Time wasters. But it's not about wasting time. It's about like, like, killing. We're killing time. time. We're wasting time with like Tommy guns. It's yeah, like, we're it's, wasting time. It's like a time travel slash like nineteen twenties gangster crossover. <laughs> that we're the time wasters. <laughs> There's some really good shows we're coming up I know. Up. Time Wasters, Red Heaven. All right, we need to just, like, hold a meeting with AMC. Just have, like, a pitch meeting. Like, here's all our ideas. I like it. Give us a million dollars, please. All right, guys. So, as you know, me and Brent like to do a comment of the week. Comment of the week. week. Every week. 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 And this week, our comment comes from Tesla Info. Oh, I know that guy. I like that guy. Yeah, he's pretty cool. Cool dude. And Tesla Info says, hey, guys. Hey. Hey, Tesla Info. How's it going? Anyway, so uh, yeah, he's our uh, biggest fan. So, um, we love Tesla Info. Shout out to Tesla Info. You got great videos, dude. Keep it up. Keep going. You're going to go big. You're going to go places someday, yeah. kid. We should cast him in one of our shows we were just talking about. Yeah. Which one do you think he'd be good for? We got... Uh, Not we got, Red Heaven. That's... Okay, we got Geek Mythology. Unless he's like the, he's like the prophetic kid who's like sort of like speaks cryptically about everything, you know? Yeah. Like, you got our protagonist, maybe you, you're the protagonist, mm -hmm. and, like, this little kid just keeps some creepy, like, prophetic things, like, watch out for the Red River. And yes! Like, what does that mean? What is the Red River? And then I could shake him, and then he would disappear into the And then night. it turns out the Red River isn't actually, like, a river, but it's, like, the name of, like, this, like, Another secret TV building show. or something. <laughs> <laughs> Another crossover. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Yeah, we're casting building. you. We are casting you, baby. All right, Tesla Info, we're casting you. Be Get ready. Be expecting a phone call. I when like we it. make Red... Red Heaven. Red, Red River. Red Heaven. Red Heaven. Red River. Red this is coming together. Geek mythology. This is just coming together. I like it. I like Netflix, it a lot. Netflix, we're going to own our own, like... Uh, Maybe we should just start our own Netflix. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Maybe we're Brentflix. just... Brentflix. Brentflix. <laughs> we'll call it Brentflix. <laughs> yes. We're taking... Brentflix. We're coming after you, Netflix. Yes. We're putting you on notice. We put Amazon on notice previously. <laughs> Coca-Cola's on notice. Bravo Network is on notice. Now, <laughs> now Netflix. Netflix. You better watch out because Bobby and Brent are coming. We're coming for all of you. All right, all guys. Real. I think that's it for this week. I think that's it for this week, too. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Bobby. And I guess I'm Brent.
Brent Flix. I'm Brent Flix. <laughs> and you are watching... Learning with Bobby and Brent. <laughs> Brent, look what I found. What do you got there, Bobby? It's... it's the box of truth. The... the box of what? The box of truth. They found it at a, at a hidden temple. What is... And, what is the box of truth? I don't know. I, I heard that there are... Well, well, hold on. What are you doing with that? I'm gonna open it. Well, are you sure you want to do that? Bobby. I heard it gives you godly power. Well, think about... Oh, well, I think you should think about this for a second before you go and open that, Bobby. Let's do it. Bobby? No. No, Bobby... Oh! <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Where are we, Bobby? I don't know, Brent. What is this place? I think... I think we're in heaven. Heaven? <gasps> 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 This is not heaven. No, no! And you'll never escape! No! <laughs> Next week on Red Heaven. How do we get back home?